Hello po mga kababayan. Hello teman-teman. Sawadee ka. Xin chào các bạn. Hello and welcome to NIA Global News. I am your English news reporter Angela. The following is this week's top news. Number five. The NIA promotes the carefree COVID-19 vaccination program to encourage foreign nationals to get vaccinated. Number six, the FSC approves digital banking for new immigrant children. Number seven, European Commission recognized the vaccine certificates issued by Taiwan. Number eight. Authentication services simplified for new immigrants in Taiwan. The NIA promotes the carefree COVID-19 vaccination program to encourage foreign nationals to get vaccinated. To improve vaccine coverage, the NIA launched the carefree COVID-19 vaccination program. The program emphasizes the four principles: won't be reported, won't be seized, won't be charged for any fee, and won't be banned. This is to give migrant workers peace of mind. The FSC approves digital banking for new immigrant children. The FSC now allows new immigrants to open digital accounts for their underage children. There are currently five banks in Taiwan that are beneficiaries. As long as parents are ARC holders, accounts can be opened for children above seven years old. The European Commission recognized. Vaccine certificates issued by Taiwan. The European Commission announced that it now recognized vaccination certificates issued by Taiwan. The CECC stated that the public can download and use the application. When going to Europe, the public can just scan the QR code for verification. This can reduce the processing time. Authentication services simplified for new immigrants in Taiwan. To encourage new immigrants to enroll at schools and work in Taiwan, the Ministry of Education announced the project for recognition of new immigrants and their children's foreign primary and secondary school qualifications. All they must do is apply for certification at the local government to reduce the burden on new immigrants in Taiwan.